everybody and welcome to Uprising 144K. I'm Hydrogen Man. So guys, a lot of people have been asking, is alkaline water the same as hydrogen water? The simple answer is basically no. I mean, alkaline water was a big craze back in the day and that's actually, they didn't really realize till later that inadvertently you could possibly be creating some hydrogen, which appears to be why some people were getting benefits from the alkaline water. But just think about it this way. If alkaline water was truly what was giving you the benefit, you could literally take tap water and just put baking soda in it and boom, you got alkaline water. It'd be that simple, but unfortunately it isn't that simple. Hydrogen is ultimately what's giving us the benefit. And if you know anything about hydrogen, you know that it's pH neutral. So whenever you see devices that change the pH of the water, you literally know that they're making hydrogen water the wrong way. If you make hydrogen the correct way, it will basically be completely pH neutral, where you're not really manipulating the pH in some drastic way. So the simple answer is, is that hydrogen is ultimately what you're looking for. You're not looking to just change the pH of the water. And so many things can change the pH of the water from whether it's minerals, or even salts, or you could change the pH through direct like ionization or electrolyzing the water in a particular way. There's just different ways to change in the pH, some which I wouldn't even think are very healthy. Some might be okay like a natural kind of slightly alkaline mineral water. It's really important again how the pH or how the alkalinity would be created because you know a lot of people don't understand that in the stomach your stomach is designed to be acidic because the acidity can like break down food which makes it better in order to be able to absorb the nutrients from your food and it's also designed to literally kill like bad bacteria that you don't want entering your GI tract so you don't so you really want to keep your acidity in your stomach at proper levels. You don't wanna be manipulating it by changing the, t the pH of your stomach, guys. And you know, a lot of people don't know that as you get older, you actually make less and less acids in your stomach and you actually want them to be at healthy levels. And this is actually one of the reasons, I, I might make a video in the future, but this is one of the reasons that I really believe that as you age, you should literally be changing the way you eat. The way you eat really depends on the age that you are. For example, when you're a baby or if you look at a baby cow, they drink milk, but as the cow ages, then they're really eating greens. They should be eating grass. I think it's the same thing with humans. Maybe when you're a baby, you can have milk, but you really shouldn't be having milk as you get older. You really should be getting your nutrients or your calcium or whatever else in different ways rather than through milk. I mean, it's even shown through science that as we age, a lot of us don't even continue to make certain enzymes in order to be consuming milk. It's almost like our body's letting us know, hey, we need to transition into a new way. And so back anyway to the alkalinity versus the hydrogen. They're very different things, guys. What you really, really want ultimately is your hydrogen. And you wanna make hydrogen pH neutral. It's really, really crucial, really important to understand this in order to get the proper benefits from hydrogen and even simply just to make it correctly. Of course, as most of my viewers know, if you wanna make it properly, you can check out my other videos in order for it to be really effective, in order to be safe. But in the end, guys, I hope this answers everybody's question. Thank you all for watching. Don't forget to subscribe, like, and share if you think other people might actually find this information uh, helpful to them. And that's all, guys. Thanks for watching. I'll see you guys next time on the next one.